G'day everyone, thank you for tuning in. Product review time. We're going to take a look at a piece of backup software I was asked to have a look at late last year and basically ran out of time to have a look at it. As you know, I rely on ESUS. I think their backup applications and software are exceptional, phenomenally good. However, the home version, ESUS Home, is limited in functionality unless you buy Home Premium or you buy ESUS Lock, Stock and Barrel. Now, obviously, I can't afford that. However, I was, I was asked to have a look at this new one that's come out that I've never heard of um, called AOMI. AOMI Backup are full. Now, okay, you all know I make idiotic, stupidly dumb mistakes, and I have. This one I have. I, I've, I've. If you're a stupid idiot like myself, which there aren't actually that many of us out there these days, and left your BIOS in legacy mode without actually thinking, which is what I've done, you can't use ESUS to restore from legacy to AHCI, which is what I was supposed to do. Yes, I admit I am dumb. Dumb, 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 bloody dumb. Stupid, idiotic, dumb, dumb. Yes, back out IT is a dummy because he's left his BIOS in legacy rather than AHCI. Now, I would take it that there's probably only one of me in the world that's been that damn stupid. Now, the problem I've got is, is that if the hard drive dies, I can only use ESUS Home to restore back to dumb legacy mode. Back out of dumb legacy mode. However, with AOMI, according to the documentation, it will restore back to an AACI or a RAID platform. Now, it is a Windows-based backup software and I was asked to have a look at it so I thought we'd give it the backyard treatment and go and have a sticky peek at it. Let's get into it. Alrighty, so here's the installation of it. As you can see it's AOMI or AOMI Backupper Standard. We'll install it now. And from what I gathered this this is better than um, ESUS from what I've been told in its in its abilities. Be being a free piece of backup software. So let's let's have a look at this. Okay. I'll leave a link in the description below to AOMI's website if you want to go and get it for yourselves. I'm not actually sure what it's doing here. <laughs> oh right, wow. Okay. So Let's go and have a look at it. So we can check the image, create, bootable, explore, mount, merge images. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Clone. That one needs the pro. Okay. Restore. Back up. Hey, this looks actually pretty easy. Okay. Ooh, okay. So you can do a full sector by sector backup of the drive. So that's actually really good. Or use the... Ah, I see. So that's actually another good little feature. You can have it email you. And split it, you can do compression. Okay. So the clone, a full system clone.
universal. Oh, I see. Okay, righto. How much is that, I wonder? I'm going to have a look. Okay. Yeah. 50 bucks Australian. Lifetime free upgrades. Hey, that's actually really cheap. That's nice. Okay. All right. So that's good. Clone a partition or volume from one drive to another. Okay. Right. right. So that's good. Disc clone. So you can actually add another disc and clone, clone your entire drive. This actually looks really good. This actually looks really, really good. Um... Back it up and back up the partition. Okay, let's um, let's do a system backup to my four terabyte drive. And let's see how long this takes. Oh, jeez. It's, uh, it's a hell of a lot quicker to do this than what ESIS is, because ESIS sits there for a while while it checks the volume. This has already checked the volume, backed up the information of the storage device, and it's already beginning the backing up of C drive. So this is actually fairly quick to get to this stage compared to uh, ESIS. That's um that's actually really quick. This might actually be something I I use fairly regularly, actually. I'll cancel that for a moment. Um, I'll leave the description in the below. Go and check it out for yourselves. But I think I'm actually going to start using this myself because it's actually got a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff in there. Um. You know, you can do a file backup. Um, add a whole folder. Let's go this PC. Let's see. And it's already backing up. Let's... That's actually really quick compared to ESIS. That's much quicker compared to ESIS. All right, well, I'm going to test this out. I'll leave a link in the description below for you to go and have a look at it for yourselves, see what you guys think about it. Um, but I think I'll, I might start using this instead of ESIS because this looks like a much better... Um, backup application. I know that's a tough call because I, I, I have always sworn and enjoyed using ESIS, but this is much quicker, much quicker. There we go. I'll leave a link in the description below. Stick around, plenty more coming up today. Don't forget, 7pm tonight, Australian Eastern Daylight Time, the Backyard TGIF live stream conversations. Until then, we shall catch you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.